Alrighty, well hello there. Here we are on Thursday, May 20th, 2021 at 8.46 p.m. up here in Northeastern Ohio. And we have a 63% moon way high up in the sky. And it's over in the south right now. We don't have the best sky conditions tonight. It's pretty much a whiteout up there. <laughs> Not quite, but because we can see something. <laughs> anyway, there we go. All right, anyway, once again, we have the uh, Canon RA with the Tamron 70 to 200 with the wide field of view and we have the Canon R camera and the RF 800 lens but we do have the uh, 2x extender on there tonight so we're at 1600 millimeters times 10 we're using that uh, in-camera focusing zoom which you can't do if you're recording into the camera but I'm recording externally so we can capture it but this is a good phase of the moon to check out the features down here. And as usual, I'm having trouble with the handset. But we'll try to scroll around here. Get up here to our... mountain range that is such a cool feature and our boneyard over here <laughs> with that one skid mark a real long one up there So interesting. Okay, we're too bright. There, we'll try that again. So we had to darken it up a bit as so we head down the side. And there we go. What I call the mesa and the light beam area, along with our question mark. <laughs> and try to get this handset moving on along. Get back down here. Yeah, I like this phase of the moon. So we can really see the depth of the craters and like the rocks that are in the middle. And it's quite funny that one area looks like a crack. <laughs> Like a long needle up there, just placed down. Anyway. And I just wanted to try out at 5x with the focusing zoom. And full on at 1600. Well, now I have been quite disappointed in not catching any odd stuff the unusual, weird, <laughs> wily stuff that zips around up there. It's been quite a while. Yeah, they are rare captures and so incredibly cool when we capture them, but we've been frozen out here <laughs> for way too long. Oh, by the way, <laughs> my little critter friend, that possum, is still running around my backyard. He's been here every morning since I last uh, posted that one incredible photograph where he let me get so close. But the poor thing was so frightened, I think. <laughs> he wasn't moving. But yeah, he's been out here every day, so I have some animal welfare people coming out tomorrow. 
and hopefully be able to pick them up. Alright, so I'm not going to do too much more footage here. I have a feeling that people are getting way too tired of my sky videos as my view count has gone down so dramatically. I barely hit 500 views on the uh, last video from a few days ago, so... And in my other ones, about 1,000. That's a lot different from the <laughs> hundreds of thousands and millions of views I have on other videos, so... Either people are tired of me, busy, or what have you. You never know. But I gotta tell you, with over 71,000 subscribers and only getting 500 or 1,000 views is, uh, well, it is disheartening. So, anyway, I guess I'm in one of my moods. <laughs> I'm allowed. I'm an old lady. <laughs> All right, so far I haven't seen one fly by. Nothing up there in the sky. Very milky sky. So we'll close it out for now. Anyway, for a few of you that are going to come over and watch this, I'm going to wish you all a great weekend ahead. Actually, I wish that for everybody. <laughs> anyway, y'all take care. Maybe I'll do a fast forward. I don't know. I don't know how much effort I'm going to put into this now. We shall see. Anyway, it is now 9 p.m. up here in northeastern Ohio. Y'all take care. Bye now. I love hearing the birds out here once again. Yeah. I know. You want me out of your backyard, huh? Okay. <laughs>